Hi guys. Hello. <laughs> we're back with makeup. Yes. <laughs> feeling really cute now. We're feeling really cute and really special. Yeah. Same um, clothes though. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, right. So I gave her a few things to try, and right now I'm actually looking for them on Sephora. Because I like them. Yeah, she really did like it. One of them was yeah. the Pore Refine, wait, Pore, there it is, Pore Professional Face Primer, um, which a lot of us know is absolutely fantastic. <sighs> I want my whole body. I know. I want this Such all over my body. feeling. It's, it feels so good. <laughs> it's so good. Now I'm going to tell you right now, you don't want to buy the standard size. You want to buy the big ass one. Okay. So size. yeah, it's <gasps> the, yeah, but, 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 but this one, oh, I got to break my heart. I know. With that price. I know. You know what? Next time they have a sale, I'll see if I can get us both one. This is fifty-four dollars, which I think most size. of them are pretty much aware because okay. they, yeah, they're probably crazy about this stuff too. If not milk, which I have to try milk again because I, I don't know. I've been playing around with my moisturizer, so I don't know if it was a moisturizer that made milk fail, but it just royally fucked up my makeup and I, I had to start all over again so yeah. it, it might have been the moisturizer so I don't know but I'm gonna try it again I'm gonna try it with what I normally wear um, and see what happens and then I'll let you guys know um, but this one right here is actually that size right there which is $32 and if you buy $32 yeah so if you buy the double size you're saving money because otherwise it's 64 okay yeah so you're better off and I have a big one in, in mm -hmm. the bedroom right now okay and trust me you will use this stuff and you use very little I mean you saw how little it's like yeah. less than a pea size right so this stuff is fucking genius I, I love it I love and then I had I her like try <laughs> <laughs> I want everything to be five dollars <laughs> yeah me too I, I you know I have to totally agree with her because again these prices are only Ugh. as high as they are because you and I ladies allow it men get products at a fraction of what we pay because they refuse to pay the prices. So we need to stand up to these companies and say, you know what? I want the value and I want the price dropped because there's no reason for it. I don't give a fuck what they say. Oh, but we ship it from blah, blah. Bullshit. Mm -hmm. It is all a load of horseshit. You do not need to be paying that price. I'm sorry. Um, the other thing that I showed her, which she really liked, oh. uh, is the Benetton. Yes. This stuff is, I love this stuff. Uh, which I actually should have put a little bit on my lips because you have rosy lips, but yeah. I don't. So I'm going to do that right now. Where's that? Where's that mirror? Sorry. I'm going to just do a little bit really quick. I'm just going to go like this. And I love this stuff so much. It smells so nice. I know. It smells because you know what it is? I think it's rose. Oh, that's what it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There you go. Do you do this after your like lip balm or whatever? Or you can do it on top or before. It really. Okay. I mean, look at that. I've got lip balm on. Okay. Bleh, lip balm on, but yeah. Okay. And I usually use just bag balm when I'm not going out. Um, but otherwise, I like uh, those liquid matte lipsticks, the ones that actually stay. Because my face has a tendency to just absolutely eat makeup. I, I don't know what the deal is. It just like inhales it. It's mm. gone. But. The NARS that I've been using, love it. NARS, I love you. Again, yours is a bit expensive, but I do love you because you make my skin look beautiful. <sighs> I do, I really do love it. So, again, I fell down the subscription box craze and I thought, let me see what the rave is with all this stuff. And I found a lot of boxes, which I'm going to be talking about in a lot of these episodes. Bottom line, what I find is these are actually trying to fill a void. And you need to find out. I know. <laughs> and you need to find out what void they're trying to fill. Mm -hmm. um, because you don't need this box to tell you to love yourself. You really don't. Um, that's, I mean, to me, that's really sad again marketing background they are playing to your emotions if you don't love yourself mm -hmm. find out why because you're worthy of being loved okay and you need to find out who and what makes you feel like that 
because this box, especially this box, is fucking garbage, <laughs> is not going to make you feel loved. Yeah. Those socks, those Forever 21 socks. I, they're not literally Forever 21, but it's just like, yeah. Like, and I don't, my socks are black. <laughs> I don't wear. I will say this smells amazing. Whatever this thing that's in here, I opened this earlier. This thing smells amazing. Well, not easy. Oh, what does it. it say? It says Spongeal Lavender Vanilla Beyond Cleansing Body Wash Infused Bath. I would love to sleep in a bed that like has this scent. Oh, that actually embedded smells really, in the really sheets. pretty. Holy cow. It right? Really smell pretty. That is like the only thing I liked about this box is the smell. Supposedly this is dermatologist tested. Um, I kind of wish I could tap into uh, Shireen Idris and uh, Dr. Dre and find out if they do approve of this because uh, I won't know until I try it. Um, mm -hmm. I don't even know what the ingredients are. Oh, here we go. Glycerin water, sodium stearate, which is not bad, sorbitol, Propylene glycol. See, I don't know what half this stuff is because we're not chemists. Um, I know. That's the annoying part. It is. So, hey, you know, chemist confessions, if for whatever reason you guys end up watching, I would love for you to do reviews on a lot of the products that we show. Uh, not a lot of them, but specific ones that I ask about because I want to know if there really is a benefit to this stuff. And if anybody knows, it would be you. Yeah. So here is the product. And again, I'm going to list it down the bottom. Wow, that glare is pretty strong. Um, it's just annoying. Like, you keep seeing, like, these ingredients on there, and you have no idea how to even pronounce them, let alone, like, what they are. And you just go online, you start hearing things of, like, oh, this chemical is found in, like, rat poison. And, like, yeah. all this other stuff. And it's like, why is it, why is it on my and body? Yeah, why like, am I putting this... Why are we doing these scientific names when the average consumer can't even pronounce them? Hello. Let alone like know what they are. Exactly, you know? and what it does for us. I would rather have the ingredients tell me in plain English what it is and what the benefit is. Yeah. And if there is no benefit, get it the fuck out of my product. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, we have no idea what this is like. All I know is oh, I'm not entirely impressed Body wash, infused. especially by these. Oh. Did you use these? I want to use this. I want to use it. It's a, really? it's a, it's a, we might fight over it because it does look good. <laughs> it, yeah. Oh, it smells amazing. You see, it's a sponge. It's got infused with something. My concern is if it's gonna like all wash out in a single wash. I'm wondering about that too. Or like, is it gonna? Because every there's nothing left in the box, so it's like yeah. Is How this long will it really last? Yeah. You know, it's funny because Bobo ended up getting something like this at, um, for men, uh -huh. at, uh, one of those, you know, like Marshalls or TJ Maxx or right. something. Right. And I don't know how many times it lasted him, but it wasn't that long. It wasn't as long as it said. Yeah. So, Should yeah, that'll be interesting. I will say this, though, the, mm -hmm. the thing that I showed you guys in the previous video, the Japanese, um, washcloth. Mm-hmm. That stuff saves. Yeah. Oh my God, does it save? And again, you only want to do that once or twice a week because it it will exfoliate you. It will. Mm -hmm. The one thing that I really liked about that sponge um, or washcloth, whatever the heck it is, mm -hmm. is that it leaves your skin smooth, smooth as hell. I mean, forget a baby's bottom. It's smooth. Can I just like instead of like getting, like on my deathbed or like or like in like you know the airplane like when the the mask drops down like can it just be amazed with this like, like I want to die. Take that home with you this. if you I'll want. I don't know box. how long it's gonna last. Yeah, I'll but, take the box. Yeah, totally. Oh, and then I can't, it, what Let's sucks it. is that I want to use this, but uh -huh. at the same time I want you to have it. You don't want to cut it. But I want to. <laughs> Oh. oh my god, you know what? We're gonna cut it. We're gonna totally cut it. You take half and I'll take half. Okay, solved. Yes. Solved. So, we'll find out. We'll let you guys know. Um, I dove into this because I was craving something sweet uh -huh. and it was the only thing that I had near me and <laughs> not impressed. <laughs> I'm a huge chocolate chip cookie fan. Mm -hmm. Was it chalky? Didn't this powder? They didn't taste like anything but bland. Uh -huh. So, Belgian boys, you're yeah. really cute on here, but... 
It's nice graphic design, but... Yeah, it really actually is nice graphic design. I have to say that. I do I like the package. Package. Yeah, the packaging is really, really cute, for sure. Mm -hmm. Absolutely but sure. Taste. But the taste was beyond average. And then these claim to be Beyond a, average or below? Oh, below average. Below. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, thank you. God, that would have like come off really bad. Mm -hmm. So these are the Belgian chocolate chip cookies, which again, you couldn't taste any chocolate chip. It just tasted like... It tastes how terrible your single life is. <laughs> oh. You... Okay, do you see how you smell chocolate in there? Uh -uh. You did not taste chocolate. Mm. You did, I mean, the chocolate chips were like, and I understand, because they're like tiny little cookies. Mm -hmm. They're like little mustache cookies. Um, but you didn't... I oh, would, they're literally mustaches? Yeah, they're like... Oh, same. okay. And they're probably like this big, so the stash is like that big. They're literally... Okay. Yeah, they're literally... <laughs> They're half the size. Yeah, they're half the size of what it shows on here, so they're really, really tiny. They're like the size of my thumb. Yeah, basically, like that. That is lame. That makes me more mad. And you had like maybe half the bag full, so it wasn't really, I mean, it just, so it's half air. Yeah. And then these. Oh, nice of them to put cookies in our bag of air. Yeah, exactly. And then these are the original Belgian specu speculos. Spe I don't know, whatever. Yeah, speculoos or whatever. These were similar to those bear cinnamon gram things. Um, and I have to say that the bear cinnamon gram things actually taste better. I did not look at the ingredients until right now. And oh my god. What's on? Candy, sugar, syrup. What the fuck? Candy, candy sugar, syrup. Not even candy. Candy, sugar, syrup. Concentrated butter. Yeah. Okay. So, raising agent, sodium, hydrogen, carbonate, salt, and cinnamon. Oh, so they did put spice. Yeah. Just not enough. It it, it was like a knockoff. Okay. Of it says may contain traces of cocoa. Stone. Oh, that's normal. Because of people with allergies. Okay. Yeah. But seriously. I was going to say, I was like, is that referring to the minuscule chocolate chips? Oh, no, this is the minuscule oh, chocolate chip okay. one. So this one claims to have... Whole wheat flour, wheat, wait, wheat flour, wheat flour, sugar, Belgian chocolate chips, no, not really. Um, cocoa mass, cocoa butter, dextrose, emulsifier, margarine. Soy what? Soy, oh, soy lunch, okay. So, not the best ingredients. I don't know if these guys claim to be healthy or whatever. What no, is, they actually don't. What is rape seed oil? Grape seed oil? It doesn't have the G. Oh. I think they meant grapeseed oil. Okay. <laughs> I would hope that they meant, I don't know. What I was I, like, what is that? That's really seed? scary, but yeah, I have no idea. Okay. But nothing mm -hmm. that I would ever want to buy again. And honestly, if I was a depressed single person that just broke up, this box would make me very sad. Um, very sad. Because, really? What is that? A necklace. And then... I mean, I know that a lot of you guys like this stuff, so I can't really... How much is this box? <laughs> <laughs> you don't even want to say. Oh my I'm god. Looking, I'm looking at this, and it's like Forever 21 jewelry. That's like, I don't know, I would pay like $2 for. Um, this box, I, I think, was $39.99. Let me see. Here. I think. Get A your box. $40 box full of... Crap. Forever 21 level products. Yes, 40 bucks, 40 bucks, 40 bucks. So this thing, okay, you might use. It's one of those things that you stick on the back of your phone to hold your phone, but how okay. long will it last? You know what I mean? It's like, a, not a pop socket, but it's like the same idea. Yeah, so you just kind of like slide your hand in there. To, I, don't I don't even know how well it's gonna hold. I don't either, but I might it's, try it. It uses 3M tape. Mm. Well, it might work then. Mm. If it's the good stuff. Mm. Well, actually, it looks like there's like a full plastic part. And it looks like the tape is... Should I just open this? Yeah, sure. Like, it looks like the plastic is overhanging the tape, making it stupid. Oh! It's barely there. So it might it might not work. 
Yeah, this tape is a. It doesn't even look thick enough to say that it's gonna like hold onto the phone for very long. And this, I don't know. I feel like anything like a pop socket or anything like this like is fucking terrible for your wrists, anyways. Like because oh, all that's the a good weight, point because you're holding it like this. You're going like this, and you're putting like all this weight in your hand, and like you're just fucking up your hand. Like, and you know, that's actually a really good point because I I work for an orthopedic. Um, actually several orthopedics a while ago and you do end up with certain common related injuries yeah so yeah that is something that you do want to think about even with our phones and walk I don't have my phone because of course it's right there mm -hmm. but let's pretend that this is my phone you want my we're, phone yeah sure you know being that we're constantly like this yeah we're actually hurting our neck and our yeah. back so one of the things that I was told is to actually hold your phone out here, which a lot of us don't want to do because, you know, we feel however. Mm -hmm. Oh, look, we have a pop I have a pop <laughs> it. But it's terrible for me. But, but you can do this. So that's where you want to get smart. Um, it's really all about uh, posture and what's that thing called that you have to do at corporate America. Um, Oh my Ergonomic? god. Ergonomic? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, I'm like, I haven't said that in so long. Sorry. So be careful. Again, mind mind your body. Yeah. Mind your body. So it also comes with, which might be cool. A I don't fake know titty. Yet. No, not a fake titty. You're so bad. A um, makeup drop. Um a silicone makeup drop. Yeah. It so, feels like a fake titty or like those, I just like the way that they feel. It's a lot of fun. Those like little gel pads for your wrists on the computer. Yeah. And I have a, a knockoff thing similar to this that I, oh, it's right there on the other side of the makeup that I got from my makeup caddy. And I had no idea what it was until Sophia and I guard. Thank you. One year later, you made me realize what this thing was for. Um, I watched one of your videos and I'm like, wait. Don't I have one of those? I just want to bite it. Yeah, you just want to play with it. It's just like so, urgh. So this is probably going to end up being my worry stone because I just tried this to put my makeup on before we started videotaping again. She Ooh, did too. Excuse <laughs> you. Ooh, baby. <laughs> um, and it didn't do the job. Yeah, now, I didn't like it. I feel like it needs a texture. Yeah, and it could be that this one, because I'm feeling this one. You know what I would like to Look see? at how floppy this okay. is. Okay. I'd like to see a com hold on a combination. Oh. So I want to see like this texture wrapped around the silicone because Wait, your maybe makeup. Wait, shouldn't say anything. But you should say <laughs> Shit. Don't say anymore. Okay. Stop. <laughs> Scratch that. You didn't hear anything. Beep. <laughs> so anyhow. Uh, that might be a good idea. Uh, I don't know how this one's gonna be. I'm gonna give it a try. This one, as you can see, is extremely flexible. If you can even, yeah, you can. You can kind of see that. Very, very flexible. This one seems a little sturdier. Yeah. Maybe it has texture. I don't want to open it right now. I don't know why it's so big. I don't either, but I do like that it has a corner, and because yeah. you can, you know, get into these little spots. But yeah, but that still, is kind of big. It doesn't. I don't like them at all because it's like it's just smearing. I. And it's. Like you might as well just use your not finger. Apply product to your drop. Lightly dab, draw, or outline onto the face. Blend gently into skin. Use the tip to sharpen lines. Blah 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 blah. So we'll see. Meh. I know that this one doesn't get it, but I will say it's great to play with. So last thing in there. Oh yeah, oh, the no. necklace will never be used. This I will try. It's a sculpting and strengthening mascara. Right now, I use, um, yeah, sure, because you actually have them, so that's perfect. Right now, I use these two, Bare Minerals Flawless Definition Volumizing and just regular Bare Minerals Flawless Definition. They also came out with Lashtopia. I fucking love their mascaras. I had to stop using their makeup because it's not working on my skin anymore. And I've been using their makeup since 2004. But I looked in the mirror one day and I kind of like, ah! <laughs> so I, I can't mm -hmm. use their stuff anymore. But this and their Lashtopia, the best. She actually put some on. 
best stuff that I've found to date. And I've been getting little samples from all these boxes and they don't, they don't map, they, what's, what's the word I'm looking for? They don't do the job. They don't volumize. They, they don't extend to reach the level. Oh my God. My English has gone out the window. They don't compare. Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. For all of you that love you? Jesus, I'm sorry, but yeah, I know. Okay. Anyway. So this stuff I love. Um, what's that game? Not Pictionary, but... Uh, yeah, pretty much Pictionary, yeah. yeah. I'm in a new categories, categories, categories. No, I'm thinking Yeah, it's a one. charades one, right? Where you like draw up on like a piece of paper. Oh, Pictionary. Is that Pictionary? Pictionary and categories, isn't it? It's something like that. I, I, I've got some games I'm thinking there. about the one from The Simpsons. I think it's Pictionary. Is it? Yeah. All right, I'll take it. But you know what? I know what you're talking about. Yeah. I know. <laughs> you guys know what we're talking about. <laughs> so um, I I feel weird that it's like there's quinoa in this because I hate quinoa I hate eating it I oh my god it. I love quinoa I have to show you how to make you're not baking quinoa right I'm okay. going to show you how to make quinoa okay please. you will never hate quinoa again it tastes like dirt it's almost... <laughs> because you're not making it right oh okay. my god girl <laughs> we will get back to the quinoa okay she will learn I will learn but this yeah that that. Mm. Let me see if I can wait. Don't Where does it fun. even? No, I'm gonna. I mean, they gotta know, right? I guess. Okay. I just oh like my gosh, there's even earrings. Yeah, no. First of all, I'm allergic to nickel. So for anyone to put jewelry in any kind of subscription box without knowing their allergies, that's kind of, I don't mean. You guys really need to rethink your boxes, and I'm talking about everyone. I'm you talking. Gotta ask people. Yeah, like, what they are you allergic yeah. to something? And you know, a lot of you have in your in your descriptions. You know, if you have allergies, you know, we're sorry. Yeah. It doesn't work that way. You're not going to get people to subscribe to your boxes if you're that rigid. I yeah. get that you're getting a massive discount. I understand that. You want to save money. You want your markup. I respect that. But you can't throw shit at people. Seriously, I, this is shit. It's a waste. Yeah, it's an absolute waste for me. And I, she won't buy it. I won't yeah. buy it. Forty dollars down my drain. So here's the. Mo, you guys can't. Let me just take it out of here. I don't know if you can see this, but it's basically something you'd want to give like your little five to ten year old, twelve year old niece, you know, to wear. And I don't have any nieces, nephews, or anything, so mm -hmm. <clears throat> maybe I'll just auction this off to one of you guys. Not auction it off. We kind of give away. Off. We can do a giveaway. Yeah. yeah, we'll do a giveaway. We kind of veered off from the mascara. Oh yeah, so the mascara. Uh, the I guess the nice thing is that it's like vegan, no mineral oil, no parabens, no phthalates. <laughs> oh, phthalates. Phthalates. Okay. No gluten. Yeah. And it has quinoa extract and baobab seed oil and it's hypoallergenic and oh, it's not tested oh. on animals so it's like it sounds good but i guess we have yet to see yeah I, I brought, we probably should have tried it before we put it on our Maybe. better mascara should i open this no no either. i'm gonna try it tomorrow okay we'll and come I'll back to this. do you know what i'm gonna try it tomorrow we're gonna do a makeup line like our makeup that we use right if you want to yeah i mean Everybody has their own makeup that they definitely, like for example, right. I gave you the makeup that I can no longer use and it looks perfect on your skin. Oh I put it on my skin I like and I look like fucking shit. I like it a lot. I look like I'm a wrinkled up apple thing being fried. So yeah, really, really scary. So we might do that. I'm not really sure. Let us, actually, you know what? Let us know in the comments section if that's what you guys want to see. But I'm going to tell you right now, neither one of us are makeup artists and we don't know how the fuck to apply makeup on in front of you. So. The best thing would probably video. just be to show you what we like. Because, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can't even... I was trying to put it on in front of her, and I'm like... Nah, it's yeah. like I, I probably wear makeup, like, 5% of the time in a year. So I don't have... I have makeup, but I don't wear it, like, very rarely. Yeah, I don't really walk around with makeup because my face just likes to breathe and be free. Yeah. So... What else have we got? The, what oh, this? yeah, this thing right here. <laughs> So oh no, that's the other one. Yeah. Um, so I know. Basura. Basura. there's only one person I think will like those, and it's probably gonna be Vanessa. Basura. Oh, and this too. 
We're so happy you decided to love yourself. Uh, yeah, and, and guys. It's not um, like filling your void. Yeah, because again, you have to realize what was the marketing point? is to make you feel. That's what it's all about. And and yeah. you got to be careful with that stuff because, again, this isn't going to fill your... This is not going to make you feel loved. It's I know it sure as hell didn't make me feel loved. To show our appreciation, we have included an extra surprise full-size item for you to enjoy in your first box. What? Oh, it's probably the mascara. Okay. Yeah, it's got to be. See, that's the only thing that's really full-size if you think about it. I mean, yeah. this is tiny. This titty is a little full -size. I mean, it's not a full-size titty, but... Well, no, but it's, yeah, but I would think it's this. Okay. I would. What was this last one? Oh, so this is some sort of halo on eye. Luminizing powder cream. I'm assuming it's a highlighter. Let's see. Oh, wow, that's a bronzing highlighter. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's going to Vanessa too, because mm -hmm. I can't use that. My skin's too light. Oh, yeah. Wow, my skin is way too light. You guys can't see this. There's no way that you're going to see this, but it's this coppery. Oh, God. Oh, uh, yeah, there's no way Go to see that. It was somewhere there. There you oh, go. Oh, there it is, right there. Okay, see that? It's actually darker than that. It's the color, literally the color, color of a copper penny, a shiny copper penny. It is. Yeah. So that's not going to work on this pale white ass skin. Hell no. Um, um, and then they gave a book. A book. I'm a huge bookworm. You know what? I might read that. <laughs> you are a badass every day. You are a badass every day. All right. You know what? It's it's kind of like look. It's our stuff. It's what we like. Mm -hmm. So this might be good. I'll read this and I'll let you know what I think of it. Ooh, we're gonna actually do little book things. Yeah. What do they call them? Book. Book, book club? Not a book club. You mean review books? A book review. Book yeah. Book okay. okay. <laughs> Struggle bus. So anyway, um, this is this box, and One. I have to say that out of the uh, how many boxes I've gotten, I've gotten quite a few. This is absolutely my least favorite. Besides this next box that I'm going to show you. Um, we're at 27 minutes. We got to, seriously? Yeah. Oh, I'll, you know what? We'll stop right here. We'll do that. That's in the next video. Yeah. So, wow, we really did talk a lot. Yeah. So we hope that you do not buy the single swag box to make yourself happy. Um, yeah. Seriously, you're better off with plenty of ice cream. And if you're going to get ice cream, make sure you get something like Halo Top because at least it's, you know, somewhat healthy. Not really. Um, but there's a lot less sugar in there. Um, and Halo Top does make some really good ice cream. Uh, get the protein, don't get the dairy-free. I usually need dairy-free, but I'm telling you right now, the protein does not bother those of us that are lactose intolerant, so enjoy the protein. Um, that said, pass on that box. Yeah, until Single Swag can get their stuff together, I'm sorry, but that is an absolute pass that is yeah. not worth 40 bucks. I think I ended up getting a minor discount and it still wasn't even worth that. And I'm talking minor, like, I think I paid 30 bucks for it. I didn't pay shit and I didn't want it. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> so, we will see you guys soon. Yeah. If you have, again, suggestions, comment in the comment box. Uh, definitely oh, constructive yeah. criticism. Other than changing our outfits, we know that. Yes, we know that. So just ignore this. We'll uh, change things up next time around. <laughs> Not next video, but next time around. Right. Um, and then um, let us know what you want to know more of. And again, hit that subscribe button. And we will see you guys soon. Bye.